Hi, here in this question we have uh, to figure out the number of solutions to this particular equation here. Okay, since we have a mod of x here, we'll have to make uh, cases here. We'll take x greater than zero. We'll have x equal to zero, and we'll have x less than zero. I'm considering x equals to zero as a different case because when x is equal to zero, this whole expression is satisfied. So I'll, you can club x greater than equal to zero, greater than or equal to zero as well. It's up to you, right? So now taking the first case, if x is greater than zero, mod of x will be x. So we have x into six x square plus one, which is equal to five x square. Since x is not zero, I can cancel out x. So we have six x square. This five x comes on the left hand side. Minus five x plus one is zero. Okay. So we have six x square minus six x uh, plus x. Uh, sorry, this will be minus 3x minus 2x plus 1 is 0. So we have 3x common here, x minus 1, uh, 2x minus 1. We take minus common from these two, we have 2x minus 1 is 0. So we have 2x minus 1 into 3x minus 1 is equal to 0. So x here comes out to be either plus 1 by 2 or plus 1 by 3. Both of these are greater than zero, what we assumed, hence both these values are accepted. Both these values are accepted. Next, if x is equal to zero, if x is equal to zero, the left hand side is zero and the right hand side is also zero. So zero is equal to zero is satisfied. Hence, x equals to zero, this value will also be accepted, right? And finally, if x is less than zero, mod of x will be minus x, right? So minus x into, we have six x square, plus 1 is equal to 5x square. So x and x gets cancelled out. Taking all the terms on the right hand side, we'll have 6x square plus 5x plus 1 is equal to 0 here. Okay. So once you solve this, the value of x comes out to be minus 1 by 2 and minus 1 by 3. Since both these values are less than 0, both these values are also accepted. So how many acceptable values are there? two from here, one from here and two from here. A total of five values are acceptable. Hence the answer to this question is five. There are five solutions to this equation here. Okay. So that's it for this question. Thank you.